How much garbage do we make? Morning. Good morning. How are you this fine morning, bright and early? Good. How's the coffee business? It's, it's doing fine. Good. All right. You have a great day, though. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Morning, Al. Bugs calling sick. It's just me and you. No, I'm just kidding. He's late, though. <laughs> Forget that, man. I ain't pouring 25 yards. Just me and you. Uh uh. There he is. Morning. Morning. You, you ready? Yes, sir. <laughs> Why do you look so tired? Are you? Come on. We're bugs. <laughs> Look how tired he looks. He can barely get out of the car. Bugs is sick today. It's just oh, us. Oh, come on. Morning. Morning. Daryl. Daryl's here with the dump truck. You can follow him out. Hey, it's Ryan from Victory. Hi, Ryan. Hi, I have a uh, 8 o'clock. Uh, I need 26 yards. 7 bag, low churred air, microfiber. Now, what do you think of this too? What do you think of just laying some plywood and buggy in it? I'm, wa I'm, mess up I'm weighing the options of pulling a truck in here and I'm thinking it's gonna be a disaster. A mess. All the rain we had. Bugs, I got these for you today. When we start to cramp. Oh, right on. I got me one and you one. Awesome. <laughs> no, that's what, I, that, that's I what they said, man. Eat pickles. I, I ate a whole Good morning. Today's Friday. We're here on the job. Um, it's a little bit before eight. Concrete is at eight o'clock. We had a little bit of a change of plan this morning. Uh, we were going to pull a concrete truck in through here like we've been doing. But we had about an inch of rain or more last night. It just came down. And it is a muddy slop hole. So there's no way we're bringing a concrete truck over that. It's just going to make a disaster area. So we're pulling the truck up the driveway. I usually don't do that, but I have permission here. And uh, we should be in good shape with that. But we're going to buggy it. I know all you guys... Out in California, a lot of the other states have your pumps, and I'm going to get a bunch of comments. Where's your pump? Where's your pump? Up here in Wisconsin, we really don't use pumps. Uh, pretty much every contractor owns buggy, a buggy or buggies, but nobody owns pumps. I don't know one residential contractor in Wisconsin that owns a concrete pump. There may be some. I just don't know any. So uh, we're going to buggy it in. It's 26 yards. Uh, it's, it's a lot easier, though, because we, saw, we are saw cutting the joints. Um, the reason we're doing that is because the existing driveway is all saw cut, so we want it to match, obviously, because we're just adding on to the driveway here. So should go good. It's, it's going to be about 92 degrees today. It's very humid, but uh, without joints, I think we're going to be in really good shape. So, all right, I'll see you when the concrete gets here. Showtime! You ready? Yes, sir. Yeah, go ahead.
It's going really good. We got this concrete down very fast. That's the secret of pouring concrete is get the concrete out of the truck and on the ground as fast as humanly possible. How many concrete crews in the world do you think have two Daryls working for them? I think none. Not like we're, these two. We're the only, we're the only so ones in the world. Is, but not like these two. I doubt it. Ready, Daryl? Come on, man. You got to do better than that. Ready? Go. There we go. Want to try, Autumn? Come on. Come on, Autumn. Get in there. Double Dutch. Oh. We're in good shape on this one. We're not. Str we're not going to struggle on this one. <laughs> Did you see me when I went up to the dude in the truck? No. I went to him and I, I said, hey, and he looked like, hey, I need you to, once he get, once he dumped that, I need you to take that and move over and give me a shot right in that crack. When he <laughs> that crack. And the dude lay back in his chair. He was like, he said, I've been having to watch this stuff. I feel bad for all the drivers. If you're embarrassed, that's a great thing if you're embarrassed. Look at that. Watch this. We just gotta clean up our tools, load up the skid steer, load up the plywood, and we're out of here. I think I should have everybody here. I'm gonna give you a bonus this week. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for the work. Oh, no sweat, man. Yeah. All right, man. Well, thank you for the work. No, thank I you. really appreciated thank everything you, you guys like have done like for us. All right, we're done on this job. It's Friday. It's around 12 o'clock. Uh, we poured the slab. You guys saw behind me. That turned out really good. Al's coming back to cut that in about three or four hours. It's, uh, it's about 92 degrees right now, the sun's on it, so it's not gonna take long. It'll be ready for a saw, for a soft cut saw that is. Uh, so you guys saw the back. We just finished putting the caps on the wall. Uh, we did this extension here. So this is pretty much done. Uh, I have to seal the stamped concrete, but I can't seal it yet. It's only been a few days. I like to wait at least about five days, even in the summer, to make sure all the moisture comes out of the concrete. Because I use a, a solvent-based acrylic concrete sealer, and uh, if it traps moisture under the sealer, uh, it'll turn milky white, and then you kind of have a nightmare in your hands. You have to remove the sealer that you put on, and it's a mess. The snapping turned out really good. That light gray that you see is going to darken up when I put sealer. It's going to look really good with the color of his house. So this job turned out really good, and honestly, these customers were they were very good to us. They, they got us lunch every day. They had coffee for us in the morning. And the guy made me laugh harder than I ever have before. I was editing video from yesterday 
I was laughing so hard I was just crying and uh, my, my, my throat started to get sore. I was laughing so hard just listening to him over again. So this was a really fun job to be at. The homeowners made it a really fun and entertaining job and we enjoyed it. So it's hot today, but uh, everything went really good. And uh, that's it. Al's gonna clean everything up with the pressure washer tonight from the carport all the way down his existing driveway. And uh, he's gonna do the saw cuts. And that's about it. It's 12 o'clock on Friday. I'm actually sending the guys home. We're gonna have an early day. Uh, we got a busy week next week. We have a big asphalt driveway that we're gonna rip out and replace with concrete. So I will see you guys Monday morning. Adios. Hey Jonas, I know you've been joking around a lot and stuff. You said you like to work, but you got my money? Um, but can... what about that layaway program you told me about? Layaway? Yeah. <laughs> All right, see you, man. All right, hey, enjoy your weekend. No, seriously. Yeah, um, thank you. You too. Y'all get like, if I had seven thumbs, y'all would get seven thumbs up. Thank you. I, I seriously mean that. Thank you. See how easy that is? You basically just plop some wet concrete on the ground, smooth it out, and people hand you thousands of dollars. It's easy money. It really is.